We're at Install Alive and we've come on to the Rothenburger stand because you can't really ignore Rothenburger, can you? They've been around a long time. I've got a few Rothenburger tools. And Anthony, he's the man. He's the most charismatic, good-looking bloke on the stand, I'm told. And he also knows how to use the tools, which is a little bit Always unusual. a bonus. This is the Robend 4000. It's cordless bending with copper up to 35 mil, and you can do stainless steel up to 28 mil, and also carbon steel, depending on the wall thickness. It's on the cordless aligned system battery platform. You've got four holes here for 15, 22, 28, and 35 mil. And then the important part, I think anyway, is you've got this bit here where you can actually preset your bend angle. Oh, blimey, that's so, great. <clears throat> really good if you... Oh, yeah, exactly. Fantastic for offsets, isn't it? Exactly, exactly. Yeah. So if we do a quick demonstration for you, there's 90 there. Make sure that's nice and tight. Now, earlier models... It's got a locking ring around the outside. It has indeed. Okay, lovely, so what yeah. I always do is check it and then just check it's not going to yeah. go out the way. So you've got... The bend shoes, so we've got, what have we got here? 15 mil, yeah, we've got 15 mil. Not as exciting as no, doing no, 28 so I, I and 35. Understand. You've got to save your tube a bit. Yeah. So your formers. Yeah. That can only go on one way. There. And then this part here. Knock it through, yeah, put your, lovely. Through there. And then you've got your bend shoe. First hole as it's 15 mil. Put that through there. Now the earlier version had a switch. Now this has got like a dead man switch, so you have to hold it. So turn it on up there, and then hold the switch. The machine will move round. You don't have to do that. You can hold it in place if you want, and it should, if I've tightened it up correctly. No, that's a 90, is stop, it? Stop. Yeah. Stop where exactly it is, and then. So. Yeah. Yeah. They're all thereabouts. That's got to be, isn't it? <laughs> you, you can't, it can't be wrong, can it? But, you know, the, the number of times we've gone, oh, just... Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean... But that's bad to do, actually, isn't it? <clears throat> Absolutely. But that's, um... There's no flattening. I, I, no. With my benders, my... my hey, minute, sometimes Multi benders. It, I get yeah. a bit of a... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Flat that's the it's where you start, start the bend off, you get that little bit of a... Not a lip, but like a... <clears throat> Where yeah, you've done it. Yeah, it just, where, just shocked it. Oh, that, that's beautiful, isn't it? It's just drawn it very slightly, isn't it? Yeah. So, so that's basically thin that yep. down very slightly, but yep. there's no ripples on it. Not at all. Do you Not have to all. put any kind of um, Bend silicon spray? spray or well, all I would say, the main bit of importance for me is making sure your bend shoes and your formers are clean. You can get a bend spray for it, but a bit of silicon lubricant, just make sure they're kept clean, just like your guides and your formers yeah. with your normal benders. Because obviously we can have quite a few issues with copper in the UK. Yeah. So we've addressed that with these bend shoes. We've actually changed the material specifically for UK copper. For some reason, when you're uh, on the continent, the copper might be thinner, thicker, and all this sort of thing. So we used to have a corded version, and we really used to struggle to try and sell it because we used to get the odd ripples and things. So we addressed the situation, and the clever people over at Rotenberger in Germany... Oh, that, and you say it, Rotenberger. It's Rot the correct pronunciation is Rotenberger. <laughs> That's worth it. You can see the copper, can't you? That's yeah, just deposited. Yeah, That's yeah. That's amazing, isn't it? Just to see, like, every time... You bend a little bit of copper. A tiny is... bit come off, absolutely. Off. Nice. Well, it's a fantastic bit of kit. One of the reasons you know, struggled with my wrist when I was on the tools, yeah, and yeah. even on 22 with a multi bender, oh. that thing just absolutely incredible, in my opinion. <laughs> but I'm bound to say no, that. I, 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 I had a stand bender up to 28. Yeah, you know, yeah, 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 yeah. All your weight on it and whatnot. Yeah.